So this morning, well, we've decided to quickly do a bit of a uh, test run with the Delica. So if you haven't heard already, we're heading to the Cape very soon. So we need to decide what needs to be done. So this is how it was in the last series. And if you didn't see that, by the way, we took the win out. Because if you haven't seen the finished episode on the Explore channel, um, we won the whole series. We won the five grand donated to Beyond Blue. So it's a bit of a weapon. But going to the Cape, that's a whole new ball game. So what better place to go than Glasshouse Mountains, the local place for us. We're gonna find some mud, a couple of hills, and work out what we need to do to this thing to get ready for the Cape. So very soon, it'll be coming another build series, and then we head up north. So today is all about finding its limits. Just send it? Sure. I think Let's we just gotta send it. We just gotta send it. You look hungover. I am. <laughs> very dusty. It's good to be back in the old girl. Oh, I've missed it, man. It's been a while, that's one for camp. Yeah, just the power, I can't... <laughs> oh. I feel, I think the front left bearing's gone. It's, it's a bit fun. There's a bit of maintenance too, but we're also going to do some mods. When was the last time you checked the oil, bud? Oh, probably not since we got back. The Deleki Deleka, it hasn't been fixed. I think we need to run past City Chief to find some oil. Hopefully they're open. And then we've got to fill up the fuel tank. I just need to top up the fuel, which is pretty good. Yeah, don't need much fuel. We need more oil than fuel, that's for sure. And we'll go find some mud. What do we need? What does the Delica take? Only the best. Luckily they're open. It's bloody sun now, they don't open till nine. It's bang on nine o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the Newell on stuff? Newell on, diesel specific. Delica specific. Oh, what is style? this? They've changed the logo. Um, yeah, 1040 is what? Heavy duty performance diesel. That's, that's got to be it. That's got Delica written all over it. Seven litres, that's us. I oh, guarantee it's not full. I reckon it's tablet cover, eh? Don't worry about it. That's a problem for later. Let's fill her up. Problem for after Cape York Peninsula. Polish her off. Still missing half the dipstick. That's floating around in the sump somewhere. We've got a bit. We need more, though. I mean, wait. We're going to lose a litre on the drive there. So we're going to do the old fucking pour down the stick. Oh, you taught me this trick. You run the oil down the dipstick. It's meant to be... Whoa! That's not working. Straight over the engine too. too. I don't know how much. We just put the seven litres in. You do it till it comes out the top, eh? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's like a radiator. Yeah, that's right. Just till it's full. Oh, where's Schmick? Spot on. Let's get that brekkie burger meal with an orange juice and two waters. Yup, and a haircut. And what was that, sorry? A haircut. Short back and sides? Short, short back and sides. Petrol? 98? Yeah, That's the stuff. We just hit some corrugations, and one thing that's in the cake is a lot of corrugations. It feels a bit rough. This is the first time it's been on these kind of roads, and the whole thing's shaking. So you may have to do a little shock upgrade. We've sort of budgeted for that, but not really. Oh my god. Got some big tires, eh? We just did a CV upgrade, you know? Well, we moved it. Yeah, we're ready for we're big, red, big red, eh? Big red, yeah. Yeah, yeah we did some, uh, we lightened it a bit, took the windows out. Here's a flash bar. Oh, we did the same mod, bro. We did the same mod. What should we put our tires down to? They're bead locked. They're bead locked? Yeah. Well, they, that's yeah. what they told me. Yeah. Do you reckon he'd notice if we just did the old switcheroo? I don't know. I reckon they'd fit. They look the same. I reckon we got this. These guys don't know anything. What are these weird tires? I've never seen Strange. that before. Oh my God. All right, we're here. We're finally airing down. There's like 45 pound in the tires, so we've got the inflate. We're gonna bang them down. Old mate said five PSI with these bead locks, so we're gonna go not to that. Go down to like 20, no 15 maybe. Yeah, I think there's a bit of sabotage going on I there. I just remember we don't have a compressor, but that's okay. Let's do 15, 15, it's pretty light. And we do have the patrol today as the backup car. We're gonna go straight to Little Red. Now I've done, never done Little Red, even in my car. So I think I'm gonna run up in that first. Cause that'd be cool, I can drive Little Red in the patrol. Tick that off the bucket list and then I can help Mitch get up, either snatch him or we'll spin around and use the winch and see if this thing will go up. It won't, but we'll try. What do you say? Yeah, we'll make it. We'll make it. We'll make it, understand. Basic setup in the back today, very basic. And when I say basic, I mean we've pulled everything out except the essentials. So we've got our Tool Pro toolkit. We might need some repairs. Brand new recovery strap from Max Tracks. A couple of snatches, some soft shackles, and of course, actual Max Tracks. So that's all we've got today. And then the winch on the front of the ute. So if we do get stuck, we can winch them out. So today, try a little red 
and then we'll try to find some mud after that. And they're the two major things that are up the telly. There's no big water crossings here, so we can't test that, but all we know about that is we need snorkels. So that's gonna happen, but we're kind of just sussing out suspension, tires, whether we need a winch or not, that's what we're doing today. Man, at least we have one good all-terrain. That's kind of all you need. All right, in front of us is the first little section on our way to Little Red. Medium. I mean, we did harder stuff at Rover. This is about medium rare. Yeah, it depends where you are. Yeah, we go. Let's just take the hard line straight up the ruts. We want to test wheel spin, see how that LSD, how tight it really is. Oh, stop Man, it. It literally feels like we have lockers. Not even any wheel spin, bro. Never oh, hang talking. on. Yeah, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, made it. He was just tricking us. He was just yeah. testing us. I think I think those tyres aren't helping our situation. Yeah, right. They are just slicks. They're, honestly, they're just slicks. We definitely might need to get a new set of tyres, but... Well, that, that was a little uphill. This is a big downhill. Yeah, this is a serious drop. Oh, my drop. God. You can't even see over the edge. You ready? I hope the brakes are good, eh? It's a serious drop, eh? Watch the Juco. Oh, that's got some flex on the back. Oh my god. Oh, we're lifting up at the rear. And the front. <laughs> Two wheels in the air. There's a bottle stuck under the brake pedal. That's all right. <laughs> Woo hoo! Stress the little things. Oh, this is a fucking weapon, eh? So she doesn't even struggle. Oh, angles, angles. Oh, damn, it feels so sketchy. Oh. Oh, fuck. It's all right, we just had the dents. Oh, just eats it up. What track? Little baby red. Not as big look. red. I reckon we can drive this. I think we can, it's eh? It's bad angles, but the good thing is it's all rock and it hasn't rained, so there is a little bit of grip. A little Looks bit like of the last Mitsubishi that came here, probably tried it. Tail light. Holy shit, man. I think if we just straddle. Yeah. That next part's the part that's gonna fuck us. That's where you're gonna smash your recorder in. So I'm gonna go up in my car first, cause I've never done that. We'll sit it halfway, so we'll try a pull. If that doesn't work, I'll go the whole way, try to turn around somewhere, and winch the Delica up. <laughs> you gotta drive the Delica. <laughs> I'll spot ya. Yeah, done. <laughs> Let's go. Put your front locker in. Is that hub in? It's locked in. My front locker would be so good right now. Try and go right hand down a little bit more if you can. So my test light, I mean not my test light. <laughs> so my locker that was working yesterday isn't working today. Definitely a locker because the wheel's still spinning in four wheel drive when it's unlocked. The locker relay clicks, so there's power to that. So it's just somewhere between the relay and the actual locker is not working. I think it's the earth because the power goes straight from the relay, but the earth is somewhere else. One week later. It defeats us again. I've, I've made a I just went to pull the plug off and the earth was hanging off. And as I pulled the plug, like we'll have a look, both cables ripped off. So there's the plug, the other plug, and these wires are like in the diff housing. So it can't be fixed because it's like flush. I have to pull the center out and pull the wires through and extend them. So. We're not even going to try go up here because the patrol would have to winch the whole way and then the Delica definitely won't do it. So, plan B, let's just maybe do the fun shit out. Or is that hectic? It's alright. <laughs> right, we'll go that way and we'll just find some mud. Just play in the mud. Damn it! It's three times I've been here and this hill's defeated me. Alright, this is a part I thought I'd get stuck at, but I didn't in the patrol. So Mitch is going to bring the Delica up and we might have to winch him, but I'm just going to uh, spot him from here. You're not even at the hard bit yet. You're joking. No worries. <laughs> While I got you, but this radio here is a limited edition GME. So because it's blue, every sale, 10% of the sale goes to Beyond Blue, which is cool. So I love using this radio. Good job, mate. Teletrack's going to be a piece of piss. Let's get out of here. So we swapped drivers, which is in the driver's seat. We just did Pretty gnarly little section, I guarantee we would have had to winch this thing up, but loved it. Oh man, it just drove it. A little bit of wheel spin, a bit of a bump up, and she was sweet. I'm honestly super surprised about this Delica. Like, when we first got it, I thought it was such a piece of shit. 
and it'll get stuck everywhere. Yeah, we like, laugh. And we're like, this ain't gonna work. But it's actually, I've read, it's grown on me like yeah. a rash. Spewing about the patrol, so we decided against doing a little red because we would have had to winch my patrol the whole way out because that front front did blue. Um, and we didn't want to spend hours dragging this thing up for no reason. So, I say we find some mud or something. Find some play hills, find some real mud and see what this thing does in the waiting. Because we never got to test it out. No, nah, it was dry where we went. A few moments later. Oh no. Oh. Go! Ready? Oh my god, that felt bad. Just throw them right I got some bed. max tracks in the packet still. Go! Go! <laughs> yes! <laughs> it's amazing. Just wait for a mate. Go! Forwards. She'll drive it! Go, go, go! Nah. My suspicions were correct. We're bogged. Oh, we'll snatch with the maxi. I was like, I don't know if this is actually soft, but we'll just give it a go. <laughs> it's fucking soft. When smoke go? Bloody freshy. How good's that? Ooh. I didn't bring my recovery hitch. The patrol really didn't do much there. That was that was all the that was the delica. We went down one thing. We need mud tires. You reckon we're gonna have a bit of a shake on the highway? We got out of the bog. It wasn't too bad. It's 40 degrees outside. It's I hot. I'm sorry. I don't think it is. That's where water goes. Little slippery, different, really sloppy hole here. We made the rules. The window's got to stay down, eh? <laughs> and then it's straight across there. Yeah, go more right. Then boost it that way. Oh. oh! Let's do that again. Oh! Just go through the middle. This hole looks f***ing deep. Let's go through the middle. No, no, through the middle. Right. Through the middle. Oh. <laughs> yes! Oh. That always went under. That's not good. No, no, that's fine. That's just a bit of heat. <laughs> we made it! This thing rocks. I think it's, I think it's deep, bro. All right, we're not going that way. <laughs> Where'd he go? Where's my slide? No! Get the winch. <laughs> Holy shit, bro. That was a... Uh... This is also the Jace Andrews rolled his car hole. Oh, really? This is where he came in and they winched out that way. Oh. You know, sort of bit of mud and pop out the other side. Yeah. All for adventure, my ass! <gasps> Oi, Sam, there's a big hole here. Okay. Go, 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 go! I'm back. We might be able to do this. This reminds me of being stuck on the side of the road in budget builds. Yeah, it does. <laughs> What's the verdict, boss? Let's winch. Oh. Okay, just to the, add to the list of problems today, I brought the trailer remote for the winch. The winch on my trailer. Not the car. <laughs> So what Sam doesn't know Carpe. is during this recovery Wait, did that get behind? I'm not going to help him whatsoever. So during this recovery I'm just going to go full reverse because he thinks the patrol is so good. Please tell me it's moving. He's stressing now. Is it moving? No, nah, I'll give it some man, we're stuck as. Okay, we just sent the strap. Okay, we just sent the strap. Strap or bull bar? <laughs> that was just a strap. I was fucking with you. I was in uh, reverse the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, he thinks his patrol's so good. Watch this. <laughs> well, now you're 
<laughs> it was good content, but. All right, I think we need a bull bar as well. So we got tires, winch, bull bar, and recovery gear. We're working it out. My tires, winch, bull bar. We definitely need a bull bar. Mitch, he was in reverse the whole time, the dickhead. He didn't get patrols that good. No, I didn't. I never said that. I wasn't the one who drove in the hole. Actually, I did Can do we this. Get a flashback. <laughs> There we go. Beautiful. Oh, oh, into the trees. When did that happen? What? Oh. Dude, that's what came off when we tried to recover it. Hold up, I'll fix it. Anyway, behind us is the final challenge for the day. This is like real flexi one batty hole stuff, which will be good to work out like scrub, bump stops, all that stuff. But the good news is if we do put mud tires on it, they're gonna be 33s anyway, which is what's on there. Yeah. So this will be a good comparison to work out what we'll scrub and all that. So it's a pretty gnarly little section. We always come here and whenever we're filming. The paper scissors are up. I kind of hope you, you drive it to be honest. No, paper scissors are up. <laughs> Best out of one. Best out of one. So it's paper scissors, shoot on rock. Paper, scissors. You say it. Paper, scissors, rock. Ah, the fuck is that? A match, you cut the match. <laughs> All right, before we go and do this, let's take a look at this week's tech tip. In front of me is an absolute array of brake parts if you can't see already. And this is the disc conversion for the rear of your dual cap. So I don't know why they still do this, but a ton of dual caps on the market still run drum brakes. It's probably a cost thing, who knows? But if you want a brand new four wheel drive with modern brakes, disc all round, this is the kit to go with. So. There's a ton of different features, obviously you're gonna get better braking. Um, a big thing is obviously if you're going off-road, drums, they can fill up with water, you can get crap in there and cause a drama off-road, so it's a bit better for off-road driving. And of course you get brake fade with drums, which you're not gonna have that issue with disc. So I've personally driven a car with this kit in it and it made an absolute difference, you could tell straight away. So what you get in the kit, that's the main thing, you pretty much get everything you need to do to convert this thing. So this is the full Bendix Ultimate 4 Drive drum to disc conversion kit. Now you'll get your backing plates, which will still have the handbrake in there, so it's compatible with that. You get the Ultimate Rotors, the 4 -wheel Drive pads, and braided brake lines as well. So you get everything you need to do this conversion in a box, hand in a nice little ice box, which you can put your beers in as well if you want to keep them cold while you're doing the conversion or watching your mechanic do it as well. So if you want to find more out about the disc conversion for your dual cab, find out more at bendix.com.au and remember to support the businesses that support Built Not Bought. Not da no dash lights, nothing. Nothing to see over there. The bonnet's up, don't worry about it, it's fine. It's not broken, is it? No, I didn't think so. It won't start, that's all right. Just needs a rest. Told you, just need a rest. I'm not like an avid four-wheel driver, actually. I actually don't go four-wheel driving much. This would be a good test to see if it'll like roll. Don't mean to scare you. <laughs> I actually drive up the beach like once a year, maybe. Still got another 10 degrees in it, I reckon. Yeah, it's actually not that bad. It's a lot better than I thought. Left hand or down or right hand down? Not telling. Yeah, right, left hand, right hand down. Oh, oh, we're over. No, you're scratching our snorkel, bro. Holy f It's leaning over a bit. You're scratching me snorkel. All right, I'm gonna try and get back over this side of the car. <laughs> hi. Oh, hi, Sam. Hey, man. man. You good? Oh, no. <laughs> I actually, that's good. I am so impressed. This car is unreal. Oh, how is this thing doing this? My car couldn't even do that, eh? Yes. We're going to the Cape. That's a success. If the market for Delicas doesn't go through the roof after this video, let's buy 10 of them. They're better than GQ it. patrols. Dude, I'm actually stunned. I love that car. The others are gonna see this and be so scared. <laughs> Dude, that's... Don't tell the girls. No, tell the girls and be like, you guys...
please click the button to your left if you want to go and check out the latest merchandise we have on our website. If you missed last week's episode, click down below to see it. And most importantly, on the far left, hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.